Hello all my little megabytes out there and welcome to another badly coded impressions video of heroines of swords and spells. I've been sitting here for about five minutes trying to say that and yeah it just wasn't coming out. So heroines of swords and spells that's what you're getting. So yeah this is a uh, um, it's a fun little, well I say fun, I haven't played it, it's a RP, oh, oh, I'll just shut up and read straight from the Steam description, come on, do that properly BC. An, ep an epic and funny JRPG adventure which intrinsically detail, hang on, start that again shall we? An epic and funny JRPG adventure with... Entricity, detailed world and story. Guide a party of wayward heroines through the perils of this fantasy world. I apologise, I cannot speak today. But from, my la from what I lack in of speaking, I'm going to make up in gameplay. So, can I just say, thank the Lord. We have got a proper option screen with music volume. I've, do, I've just literally come away from playing, well, if you could call it a game, that did ha not have any music options, hardly had any options whatsoever, and I had to go to the sound manager. Manager, but manager. But thankfully, this one has got one. So yeah, uh, and straight off the bat, this reminds me of a PS2 game, uh, but it is in windowed mode, you won't see it, but if I put it in full screen mode, literally it, it stretches so much, you cannot hardly see anything, so it's staying in windowed mode, I don't normally play in windowed mode, but it's staying there. Um, Again, a, a shout out to guys at Key Mailer. I did receive this key for free, so I am very appreciative of that. Let's get into it, shall we? New game! It's still quite loud, even though it's on 20%. I might turn it down to... The only bad thing is, you've got to turn it up to turn it down. But I'd, I'd rather take that than having no audio. Right, new game! Wisdom is an attempt to reconcile real life with a childhood dream without betraying it. Once upon a time in a far away world so different from ours. Is that it? Hmm? Where is everybody? Hey, anyone home? I was told to come by at midnight. That's not... A strange thing to do come come by someone's house at midnight but there we go Ooh. ha who dares to enter the thieves guild oh yeah it's thieves guild I should have went up there where the thieves guild it's me Diana don't you recognize me master Boris Hmm? Oh, God! Youngsters these days, can't you just be a little more dramatic? Whoops! Sorry, let me start it over. I'm Diana. I came here to become a member of the Thieves Guild. So, you're trying to say that you're worthy of the great honour of joining our Thieves Brotherhood? Yes, I am. Don't ask me to be a thief. Don't ask me to nick anything and not get caught. Because it ain't happening, okay, Gov? You're talking big. How can you prove it? But you trained me yourself, Master Boris. Mm. There you go again. Whoops. Uh, I mean, I'm worthy. Test me. Please don't test me. 
What say you, Magister of Shadows? Start the test. Hold it, Magister. We must arm the rookie first. Diana, open the chest in front of you. The guild prepared a small present for you. Hint, use the arrow key. Oh, mm. Use the arrow keys to move the character to open the chest and close doors or interact with other active elements. Move your character closer and press enter, space or Z keys. You can also use the left button, mouse button. Oh. Oh, okay. I didn't want that. Oh, right. Thieves dagger. And it's it's actually told a little fear, but I can do it all by mouth. M mouth? Yes, I can do it all by mouth. But I can also do it all by mouse. Wow. A real thieves dagger. A real? A real thieves dagger. We're not off on a good foot today. Consider it your advance. We don't have so many candidates that we can let you go unarmed. But the guild doesn't accept just anyone. You must prove that you deserve it. I must warn you that the trials won't be easy. Oh, you could get hurt. I'm ready for anything. Wonderful then. I wasn't ready for that. Wow, a secret entrance I haven't seen before. What? Did, where does it lead? You will find out soon. Go downstairs and keep your dagger close. Oh, fine. Break a leg. Yeah, I'd rather not. I am partial to my legs. I'm the character. Go to the main menu by clicking the right mouse button or by pressing X or escape. Choose equipment by pressing space, enter, or click the left mouse button. Okay. Right. Did it right. I was doing it wrong last time. Right. Let's go. This is so small. Well, shall we, shall we start the first trial? Yes. We shall. Good. We thieves are simple folk. That's why we start the test with the most important thing. What do you think the most important thing is for a thief? Uh, I was going to say invisibility, but agility is probably up there. No. Speed? No. Um, accuracy? Of course not. What's that? That was meant to be what is it then, but it just came out was then. The ability to detect coins and other things you can steal. There's no point in snooping around an empty pocket. You start by deciding what you can steal. A trained eye is the first thing a thief needs. Coins and other valuable things must be found quickly and stolen quietly. You're right, Master, as always. Actually, the first the first task is to find money to steal. The guild is built an ordinary house prototype here in the basement. Search every room and bring me 50 coins. If you manage to complete the task in two minutes, you'll get an extra reward. Don't you tie me, mate. Don't tie me. Object to mark by twinkling stars. Okay. Someone called a message of it. If you don't know how to play, just bang on the keys. Don't bang the instrument. Have a drink and a sing. Haha! <laughs> Guild members are so funny. Looks like there's something shiny over here. Ten coins! It's empty. Well, of course, it would be too easy to find coins in a coin purse. A letter. Maybe it's a love letter. 
I'm dying to read it, but I don't have time. Um, um. No, don't have time. Ha! There was some money in the coat lining until Master Bobber. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Ain't got time. Ain't got time. Ten coins. Ah, Kiwi. Kiwi, child. <laughs> um, bed. Coins in the pillowcase. What? Hey. Sorry if I'm skipping it all, but I am being timed. Oh, whatever. Looks like there's something shiny in the pot. Ten coins. Um, I'm going to fail. Ten coins. Well done. Anyone can tell you are my student and you managed to rob the house in two minutes. You've got a bright future in our girl. Take this small reward for your excellent result. However, the test hasn't finished. Get down to the next floor. I'll see you there. Light bus plate. Okay. Well, I'll equip my breast plate the correct way. Um, armor. There we go. Right back. Uh, n now maybe I could I can read this note. Yes. Thank you for playing the game. I hope you like it. If you want to contact me, report bugs, criticize or praise me. Find my contact in the game credits in the main menu. I'm looking forward to hearing from you. Huh? I can't read it. That's weird. The letters are vaguely similar to what Rodonian letters. Are they done by Rodians? But I don't understand a single word. Maybe the text is written on a language from the same language family. For example, yeah, I don't want to read that. <laughs> yeah, okay, you can't read the note, love. I understand. It's not for you anyway. Right, next floor. Wow, a real dungeon. I wonder what secrets these halls keep. Squeak! Eek! A rat! Are you afraid of rats, Diana? Um, no, I'm not. They're, they're just so disgusting. Brace yourself. All guilds use rats to test and train their rookies. Some consider this to be a tradition. Others think it's... It is really cliche. Looks like our magister belongs to the latter. He has recently bought a batch of fog cyclopses. Fog cyclopses, that's a word. But they haven't been delivered yet. Looks like you, Diana, will be the last one to kill rats during this test. Killing rats? Ew! Unlike other girls, the Thieves Brotherhood doesn't encourage constant fighting. We prefer to concentrate on other things. If a, if a thief got involved in a fight, he made a mistake. And that's a fact. Murderers from the Assassin's Guild may leave heaps of dead bodies behind, but not us. The essence of our craft is to steal wallets, not lives. However, Sometimes you don't have a choice, and that's why all members of the guild must learn to defend themselves, no matter how nimble your fingers may be. Sooner or later, the goddess of fortune will turn her beautiful but insidious face away, and you'll have to fight. Do you understand where I'm going, Diana? Um, of course. Totally not. <coughs> Are you sure? Then we're checkered right now. 
What? I don't know where that came from. Right. Attack. 60. Bang. Ow. Ow. Bloody ratus ratus. Die. <laughs> Those rats are really fast. Right. Have at your knave. Victory! 30xp! Phew! That was unexpected! For the mind the fact that the picture showed us there was one, but there was actually three. Yes, I can get one. <laughs> Only tournaments begin with a sound of a. sound of a horn. A thief should always be ready. For a sneak attack or be the first to strike. By the way. Why haven't you used that special technique I told you? Uh, I forgot. <laughs> That's what I thought. Don't forget to use it. It's better to make one perfect strike than, than to have the knowledge that you can't use when things get tough. I got it. Character skills have been updated. Diana has learned sneak attack. Don't forget to use it in battles. The second part of the exam will test your ability to defend yourself. Find the passage to the next floor. Beware of the rats. They are everywhere. Kill them if you want. But if I were you, I would not get involved for no reason. Our powers are limited and the wounds don't heal by themselves. Every victory can turn into a defeat if you don't get to an inn or a temple in time. You'll find five healing potions in the chest. Use them sparingly. The main part of this test is up ahead. I'll do my best. Good. I hope to see you safe and sound on the next floor. Okay. Quest journal updated. Okay. Uh, he just walked into the wall and vanished. Okay, right, let's have a look in there. Five healing potions, which he totally said we'd have. Um, go, 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 go. Healing potions can be used both in battle and after it. To use a potion, use the items menu. Do I need a potion? Well, I suppose I do. Right. There we go. All potioned up. Uh -huh. Right. Um... What the hell is that? Is that... Oh! They snooped! You can retreat from some battles. Press escape to retreat. But I don't want to retreat. During the game, the characters will learn new abilities. Spells and special strikes. Spells consume mana. <laughs> and strikes consume energy. TP. Why is energy TP? Mana points. And health points are restored after resting at an inn. TP are accumulated during battle for active a active actions. Okie dokie. Well, what level was he? Brown rat. Ooh, baby. Can't use that yet. Right, that's attack. The two small ones. Yeah! Ow! Ow! Maybe we can use our sneak attack special on the bone rat. Habuski! Well, that didn't work. I have a normal attack, you bastard. Yeah! 
Victory! Teach up for s teaching you for sneaking up on me. Right, how do we? Right, let's go for it. Oh shit! Ooh. Um. Great rat! Hadouken! Hadouken! Ow! 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 Have it! Yeah! Brown rat out of the equation! That oh, is nearly dead. Oh wow. Time for a normal attack, bub! I ain't out of this one yet. Ah, Boosky. Da da da! Right. What's in here? 20 coins. Okay. Ooh. Hello. Magister of the Shadows. What are you doing? Choose the lever. What? There is a red lever and a blue lever. Why does my lever sound like I'm saying lever? I am not lever. Choose one of them. What will happen? Will I learn the truth about the secret affairs of the guilds? If I choose the right lever and if I choose the wrong one, I'll lose the consciousness and fail my test. Is that right? But... Which lever is a secret lever? Master Boris didn't say anything about it. Just choose a lever. This is not fair. I understand that a thief should be lucky, but at least a hint. Choose a damn lever, Wookie. Now. Uh, I choose. I don't choose any. I choose that one. Pull the lever? Yes. Hear a noise in the distance. Something's happened. Take the healing potion. What healing potion? Oh, that healing potion. Huh? What was that about? Couldn't you just give me the healing potion? Why the show with the levers? I'll pull this one. Hear a noise in the distance. Something is opening. You've already made a choice. Why did you pull the second lever? Um, because I wanted to. I shouldn't have. You absolutely could have and should have. Well, I did. So, ha 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 ha. You shouldn't always accept the choice that was imposed on you. There are two sides of the coin. It's good that you understand it. Take this gift as a reward for being clever. I'm clever! We're good life. Nice. Wow. Thank you, Magister. This is the longest speech that I've ever heard from you. I will always remember your advice. Piss off, kid. <laughs> right. How do we... Right. I think we should possibly heal. Right, there we go. Uh, equipment. My equipment. Uh, accessories. Equipment. Accessories. Ring of life. What does that do? No, I don't want to delete it. I want to find out what it does. Oh, well. Whatever. Right, um, I suppose we're going here now to face... The big eye demon. Wow, those frog clocks. Ah, these are the frog cyclopses that Master Boris was talking about. Looks like the first batch is getting settled down in a new place. Actually, the frog cyclops have nothing to do with cyclops or frogs. They were called this because of their bizarre appearance. In 
In fact, in a special life form, slime, I don't think these current creatures are more dangerous than local rats. I can probably beat them if I ignore the master's advice. Break the gate. Hi! <gasps> there is. Uh, get the smaller one first. Nice. Ow! Ow! Oh no! Oh no, I was poisoned. Am I poisoned? Um. Right, let's get the, that one. Finish him off. Yeah! Right, let's finish him off. Nice! Oh, I ain't got enough yet. Right, let's, let's smack him on the ding dong. Blue frog cyclops indeed. Stop poisoning me! Oh, I gotta attack him again. Ah, Booski! Yeah! Now I got enough for a sneak attack. Nice. Go! Finish him off, my pretty! Too slow, frog dude! Victory! But there's nothing here. Well, if you think about it, it's not surprising. What did I vote for? Yes, you fought for water. Um, well, that was a load of rubbish. Should we heal? Maybe no. Um. Oh, better to be safe. I'm sorry. No, not equipment. Nice, full elf. Right, let's go. Looks like this lever has unlocked the store. Now we go and face the deadly Rattus Rattus. You can choose a smaller character portrait in the game setting. Thank you, Hin. Why would I want a smaller one? Ooh. Right, grey rat, brown rat. Let's hit the grey rat. Ow! Ow, 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 ow! Why have I got magic? I ain't got magic yet. Sneak attack. Ah, bullshit! Oh, it says what they're doing up there. Okay. Right, let's attack this Rattus Rattus. Brown rat, go! Ooh, he's booting me! Right, attack again. Ah, Boski! Just a uh, plain old attack now, I do it. Yeah! Victory! I like the little dance she does afterwards. Right, down the next floor. Glad to see you're alive and mostly unbitten, Diana. How do you like rats? Ew. Well, I can't comfort you by saying that you won't see them again. And uh, you'll need all your abilities for the final part of this test. But first, I'll give you my last lesson. The last lesson? Thief is not a thief if he doesn't know how to pick locks and see hidden traps. You already taught me that, Master Boris. Those are the very basics. You can easily open ordinary locks, but nobody hides anything valuable behind them. The same with traps. When did you last see an ordinary mechanical trap in a shop? Well, I've seen them from time to time, but merchants recommend the Enchanters Guild for magic traps. They are expensive, but much more effective. That's true, they are more effective. From the Enchanters Guild, know what they're doing. 
The magic locks and traps in here. Where do I get in here from? The magic locks and traps are a real headache, even for an experienced thief, unless you learn the specific technique. Fight fire with fire, magic with magic. Listen carefully, I will now teach you a simple magic spell. But I don't have any aptitude for magic. Everybody has. You aren't born a mage, you become one. Everyone has a gift though. Certainly of a different level. Don't worry, the spell is pretty simple. Magister of Shadows also ordered to give you a special artifact to all guild members. It's a thief's badge. Here, it takes yours. Why would a thief have a badge? Does it say, Hi, my name is Diana. I am a thief of the thief's guild. That's got to be a really big badge. Thief's badge. It looks like an ordinary coin, old and tempered with. Its edges are sharpened. Of course, we could order beautiful and fancy amulets from the smiths that the guards would immediately recognise the guild members and send them to prison right away. But then we decide to go with an insuspicious piece of junk. I see. But how to use this artefact? You will figure it out soon enough. First, let me teach you Thief Vision spell. Listen carefully, I don't want to repeat it over and over. Phew, I think I got it. Well done, have you noticed anything? Wow, this is... There is a strange red whirlpool over there. I haven't seen it before. It's the aura of a magic trap and it's practically invisible without the thief vision and it's extremely deadly. However, let me show you. So, what do you think? That was very dramatic. <laughs> Be happy you can see them now, but still not all of them. Traps come in different qualities. Some are harder to detect, even with thief vision. Alas, there is no universal approach. Plast plastic? Practice makes perfect. Be careful. Concentrate. Make the thief vision a part of yourself. In time, you will learn to notice the most intricate and complicated stashes and traps. But what about lockpicking? You need to, you need to, you need to learn, Jesus BC, learn to read the skill and have some lumpics. Are you ready to practice? Sure. Good. There are three chests in front of you. All locks of a different difficulty. The skill you've learned will help you figure out the mechanism's difficulty. It's hard to explain, but when you approach a chest or trap, you will feel how different the lock is. If your lock picking skill is higher, you will be able to pick it. This is where the thief's badge can be useful. I'm not a mage and I can't explain how it works. But when you want to check your skills, firmly squeeze the badge in your hand. You will see, or rather feel, the level of your skill. This is not an easy thing to, to wrap my head around. <laughs> The best way to learn how to do something is to do it. Here, take five lockpicks and try to open the chest. You will feel the difficulty of each lock. Sometimes you'll know the exact value, sometimes you won't. Your skill will get better with every successful attempt. The thief's badge will help. You keep track of the level of your skill. Do not forget to use it. Five lockpicks. Okay, I will try. The lockpicking and perception skills are leveled up in a different way than other skills. If the value of lockpicking skill is bigger than the lockpick's difficulty, Diana will be able to open a chest or door. To see traps and secret places, level up the perception skill. Oh, hint 2. To see skills level, select the thief bag's 
badge in your equipment or use the K hotkey. Right. On that note, guys, we are going to leave this here for today. This seems like an interesting little JRPG. I might uh, give it a bit more practice, as we say. I'll probably be crap at it, but, you know, whatever. But, yeah, I'm liking it so far. So far, so good. So, guys, if you did like the video, please hack away at the like button down below and maybe even do a cheeky subscribe as well. And I will see you guys in the next Badly Coded Impression video. Bye, guys. Take care.